So in this case, ladies and gentlemen, um, what we're going to do is they're asking us to find the sum of all the interior measures. Now, what we've talked about, um, Blake, is that the sum, the sum of interior angles, we represent, remember when we took all those figures and we cut them up into triangles? Because we knew that triangles, the sum of a triangle was 180 degrees. So what we did, Kaylee, was we took our figures and we cut them up into different triangles to find the sum of all the interior angles. And what we found out was the sum of our interior angles is equal to n minus 2 times 180 degrees. All right, can you flip that over, please? So then what we did is, so now all we need to do is remember where n represents the number of sides. So now we need to determine, well, how many sides does a nonagon have? Well, we know that three sides is a triangle, four sides was a quadrilateral, and then we went to five was a pentagon, six was a hexagon, seven was a heptagon, eight is an octagon, nine is a nonagon. So therefore, to find the sum, which I'll just represent with s, is just going to be nine minus two times 180 degrees. So nine minus two is going to be seven times 180 degrees. And then 7 times 180 is going to be 1,000, that'd be 350. What was it? 1,260. Any questions? OK, very good. So if I was 